Hi, this is Andrew with Design Point. I'm here today to talk to you about SolidWorks PDM and workflows. So what is a workflow and how can we use it to help us make our businesses more effective? Well, a workflow inside of SolidWorks PDM is a visual representation of information and how it travels from one user to another inside of the program. So for this example, we're just going to use a really simple workflow and these can be tailored. We can call the states different names. We can call the transitions different names. We can add all kinds of additional states and transitions, but we're going to have just three different states and they're going to be really simple examples. So to start out, we might have the state of work in progress. This just basically means that you have a group of users like the designers or the engineers and they're working on a project. It can be multiple times that they start up and stop and start up and stop, but eventually they get completed and they're actually going to submit this now. And this is going to be handed over to the next state. So they're going to submit it for approval. It's going to be pending approval. The manager is going to be looking over it and they've got two options. We're going to talk about basically them just handing this project back. They could add comments. They could say, hey, could you adjust this for me? And then it's right back in the hands of the designer or engineer. So it's in work in progress again, and then it's all finished. They submit it for approval and it goes back into pending approval. This time, instead of rejecting it, they're actually going to release this and that's going to send it to its final state. That would be maybe something called released or purchased or something that is the final state where the project now might generate a PDF and store that in a certain location, or we could send out an email notification, hey, this project is completed. So you can actually have three different user groups and they could all be interacting with the program and the project files at different states. So the project could actually send a PDF to purchasing, hey, could you purchase all the items on this bill of materials? Or it could send off dimension drawings to your staff over in the shop and say, hey, here's how you put everything together and this is what you need to do before you ship it out. And it all started with the engineers and the designers and then they hand it off to the, to the management that approves it. And then once they approve it, then it goes to the final work state of released. Now, that's just a simple example of, of a SOLIDWORKS workflow, but we can actually tailor this to whatever your business needs are. And that's just a little bit of how SOLIDWORKS PDM helps make your business more effective.